What is up, Block? Phoenix Elder here, and welcome back to another Farming Simulator 22 Mod Spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods and give you guys my thoughts and opinions, and I'll leave them linked down in the description down below so you two can go download them if you are interested. Now, I know I said today that we were going to be doing a, uh, a Minecraft video, but for some reason, my computer is not liking recording Minecraft right now. Every time I try to, it crashes, so I gotta figure out what causes that. Um, before I record anymore, so I figured uh, we, we we would replace the Minecraft Monday with uh, some a, a map mod spotlight. And today we're gonna be checking out Big Flat Texas. So I'm guessing this is big and flat, because that's why it's called Big Flat Texas. Anyway, so we start off here as a house, and it does look pretty flat. It's in the name. <laughs> Uh, there's, it's, there's a little bit of hills, but for the most part, it is, it is pretty flat. So we come over here, we have some starting buildings. Are these placeables? These look nice. I like this. Is this in game? Big garage. Oh, it is, isn't it? I'm dumb. All right. So that's in game. I'm gonna guess all these are. That's not bad looking little shed. How come I've never noticed that before? I feel like if I would have noticed that, I have, I would have definitely used it more often. Is this an in-game one, too? Oh, yeah, it's this one, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Not bad. I'm learning to appreciate uh, what's in-game more. Look at me. Alright, let's head this way. Yeah, it looks pretty flat. A water tower over there. I'm wondering if that's where the town's at. Big flat. T Look how big that field is. Holy crap. That is good size. Is there anything down this way? Probably not. We have field one, which is. looks like. grass. I don't know. They just combine field one and two, it looks like. We gonna make another left turn. There's a whop. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. I am getting tired. Turd. Yeah, okay, these fields are pretty massive. I kinda wish we could have done this on uh in the server, but you know, we're we're setting up something else, you know, so just kinda had a question. We have our shop area, not bad. Lone Star Tractor. Lone Star Goods. Does that open? I don't think it does now, right? Yeah no it doesn't open. But you can sell stuff here. Okay, so it's a sell point and it's a a shop where you can purchase and pick up your, your crap. And then right next door we have the ammo dealer and I'm going to guess like a sell point for... Aha! Yeah, probably self point for bales. All right, hay, straw, all that good, all that jazz. All right, Let's see what's down on the other side. I'm running off the road. Man, 
Whoever was asking me what is a smaller map with bigger fields, here you go. Holy crap. This map is 95% field. And there's only 16 of them. Holy crap. We got a house down here. Not bad, not bad, not bad. And, okay, so we have grain silos, both rail, and it looks like cell point. These are mad. This is what this is what you this is what you find in uh, here. Like these just massive grains. Why does more maps not have these? I like this a lot, actually. We need more of that. More of that. I had. Why have we not seen more places like that? Holy crap! They're massive. Rail yard. What's over here? Oh, gas station. Look at that gigantic building. Holy crap! Is that scaled up at all, or is that really that big? Did I miss something back here? We had sail point, and then. We had, I guess sail points over here. Yeah, two. Bakery. Okay. Alright. I see you. And over here we have the train sail point. Oh! I bounced off of that. Here come the train. Let's see what the train looks like. Okay, it's way down there. It's not anywhere close. Wait, wasn't there a war tower that way too? Okay, just your normal plain Jane train. Kinda boring. Oh, that must be the train track. Okay. I was like, wait, where's the road? Just a random water tower down there. Alright. We'll see what's on this side. That's a ginormous field, man. Holy crap. Yeah, I, I wouldn't have mind playing on this at all. At all. This is, this is awesome. Okay, so here we have what appears to be our cattle place. With some feedlots. So, can we buy? It doesn't look like. Can we buy? cows to put in here somewhere? I'm sorry, is that a door? Let me in. Maybe because I don't own it? Hold on. Let me in. Okay. Chatter. Oh, now it pops up. Look at all that. What does this do? Show grid. What's the grid for? Each one of these holds a hundred cow. Oh, wait. Do we not have enough money? Let's fix that, why don't we? Meow. So wait, we have a 
One, two, three, four. Four times two. We have eight, so that's 800 cal. Can you put them in back here? No. So, 800 cal in this little area. Not bad. Not bad at all. Is over here. Yeah, there is a war tower over there too. Okay, I'm not crazy. Just the house. All right. I'm gonna just say it. this map is pretty simple. There's not like a huge downtown area, which you know I love, uh, but there is a lot of open space. Like you could cut into a field, and you still would have massive fields. It, it wouldn't, uh, with the exception of like six. It really wouldn't take away from how massive these fields are. Uh, I I kind of would love to do a multiplayer on this and just, you know, like go to town on these fields because they are so big. Uh, but we're we're kind of set on Ohio Richlands currently. We're all getting set up and all that jazz. But this is pretty nice, and I you know I think it would be fun to, like. Three. Look how massive it is. It would be fun to tackle. Um, but yeah, you do have open space to add stuff. Uh, it is flat. You guys know I love my flat maps. I don't like uh, hilly maps or any of that. So, uh, yeah, I like it. I'll give it a 5 out of 5, though. It does look cool. Uh, and I, I do, the only really complaints I have is there's not like a little downtown little zone that just, like, make me feel like I'm... You know, going to town or anything. That's my only complaint. I do love that silo set up down there. But that's going to do it for today's video, guys. If you guys did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like down below. It does help me out so very, very much. I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future Farming Simulator 22 Mod Spotters, be sure to click that subscribe button. If you guys want to be notified whenever I do go live or upload a video, click that notification bell. And all you guys, thank you so very, very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>